Good morning. This is Frida. Uh, welcome to my channel. I'm happy to have a Dollar Tree haul to share with you. I picked these things up over a course of a few days and I'm very excited. And I, um, the first thing I have to show you is this uh, pen and I have something to say about these pens. Um, I look for these in every season because every season they come out with a new kind, uh, new design, but they're always these uh, fat pins. And I have trouble with my wrist, uh, and I have trouble holding regular size pens, so I always look for these because these are easy to hold, they're easy to grip, that my wrist and and doesn't get nearly as tired. And I really recommend these for people with carpal tunnel or nerve issues because they're much easier to grip, to grip than a regular size pen. Um, I got <coughs> one of these tinted and scented LA Colors Color Bomb. My little girl likes to pretend that she's wearing lipstick, so she wears these, uh, this type of thing. It's a, uh, it's a uh, LA color tinted and scented, and this one is uh, double bubble scented. Um, I know she's gonna like double bubble, so I'm happy to find that one for her so she can pretend she's wearing lipstick. And I found these um, shaker stickers, and they have have water and sequins inside and when you shake them the, um, the glitter moves around. Well, do these have water? These don't have water, they dry on the inside. They just have the, uh, they're dry with sequins inside. I thought they had water. Some of them have water, but these don't. I chose these because they have donuts on them. Our family has a, tri a weekly tradition that we eat donuts every Saturday morning and my daughter loves this uh, strawberry with sprinkles. That's her favorite. And my boys like the chocolate with, with or without sprinkles. So I, I had to get this one. There were a lot of other shaker stickers there, but these were my favorite. And I got some little pack bags This uh, from the Emoji Movie. Uh, we love the Emoji Movie and this one has, um, of course, that little uh, donut on it. I don't know if the kids will have to decide who gets which one. But this one is uh, treat yourself, and it's just plastic. You'll use it for pencils and pens and um, markers and things like that, whatever you'd like. I'm sure the kids will find a use. Or, you know, the boys could keep their... Um, Pokemon cards in it or something. And here's another one. I really like this one. It says, be weird, be different, and be you. So I really like this one. This is the one I would want if I were going to have one and use it for myself because I like to be weird on purpose <laughs> and be different on purpose. I've always liked to be different on purpose. So that one would be mine. I wonder which of my kids would choose that one. <laughs> and I found this um, family um, where life begins and love never ends. I don't really like very much Dollar Tree um, decor, but when I find these um, wide frames that have like canvas on them, it might not actually be canvas but it looks like canvas and if you notice really close it looks like a, a handwritten note in the background with these peacock feathers and I love peacocks so um, I had to get this uh, to put on my wall I don't think um, I don't find very much that I like there but I now and then I, I really do, and this one will really uh, fit in at our house. I found these stinchy uh, hair things. 
um, hair ties. This one came with, um, one has a bow and the rest of them are all just plain, all just plain um, hair ties. But my daughter and I go through them so fast, she plays with them, she uses them for all kinds of things. Um, she wears them as bracelets and puts them on her dolls and loses them all, all over the place. So I'm always looking for more. And when I saw the skinchy, I picked them up because um, it's useful. We won't, uh, you know, we might get to use them twice before she loses them. Um, I found these. I'm always looking for new stickers, and I like these. They're kind of antique looking, kind of um, shabby chic. Uh, nice for um, cards or letters or um, scrapbooks or um, sometimes when I color, I, I like to put stickers in it depending on how the picture looks. I, I like to make it more complete with um, with um, stickers or stamps or something. Anyway, so I, I did find the Crown Jewels um, products at the Dollar Trees that I uh, go to on a regular basis. Um, I like these stickers because I like the pineapple. It's gold and of course the elephant is cute. And they're nice, nice looking stickers. And these, I, I got this because um, I, I have a DIY in mind. I have uh, decided to, this one has a, is a little tray and it has a, a paint roller, a, a mini paint roller and a paintbrush and I guess that's those are the only tools a paintbrush and a mini roller and I thought this would be excellent to um, affix one, one of those wall decals that you can buy at Dollar Tree with Mod Podge because this the adhesive doesn't stay on my wall very well so I thought or even on some kind of DIY because um, since the adhesive doesn't stick very well uh, for a long period of time, I, th I think I'll use this uh, mini paint uh, set to put Mod Podge over the surface of the uh, decals to make them stay longer. And I thought uh, these are also a good kind of uh, applicator for Mod Podge because they're uh, very... Um, wide, and I could put a, a wide streak of Mod Podge at one time. Of course, it has a few different sizes here. I think three sizes. There's small, medium, and large, and that I thought would really work well with putting Mod Podge on the wall decals that I get. And I got... Normally, I don't buy... Uh, Walgreens um, storage bins and things but I do like these um, because these are the stackable ones and they're much stronger than the, the non-stackable ones. The non-stackable ones are much flimsier and uh, when I saw the stackable ones I, I noticed that they're much stronger and therefore worth my dollar. Um, <clears throat> I'm very very picky about the about the storage items at, uh, at Dollar Tree because I don't want it to fall apart the first time somebody bumps into it or or uh, it falls on the floor or something. I don't, I don't know if I, I don't have to remove these um, stickers, I guess, but I just have a habit of removing them whenever, whenever I buy something. I got one of each color, pink, purple, blue, green, and I'll put them in my closet. I'm trying to organize. Hey! 
what's wrong? Something happened to my computer. What are you doing, computer? There. <laughs> Something happened to my computer. Just waiting for it. Anyway, sorry about that. Well, there we go again. Yoo-hoo! Come on. What are you doing? Guess it's downloading something. I might have to redo this video. Come on, come on, come on. Okay, something is uh, updating. <laughs> anyway, there's a, uh, the latest coloring paint, paint, I mean, not paint, coloring book I found at Dollar Tree. I uh, haven't seen anyone else hauling this one. Of course, um, someone may have and I might have missed it. But it's um, the Mason Dixon Knitting Coloring Book for Knitters. And it shows all these uh, different pages of um, knitted items like mittens and um, what else? Sweaters and uh, unfinished items and a knitting convention. It's very cute for a person who knits. I think that's sweet. And I don't knit, but I know people who do. Okay. Um, sorry about my little gaff here. <laughs> anyway, um, hope you all have a really good day. We're having lots of rain and not very many beautiful sunny days right now. So, um, hoping you are all either enjoying a nice sunny day or staying dry wherever you are. Thank you for watching. Sorry about the little nuisance that happened, but uh, that's life. Anyway, um, thank you for watching. If you like my video, give it a like and uh, subscribe to my channel if you like my video so you can keep up with my uploads. Um, have a nice day or night or whatever it is where you are. Bye.